Good day! Welcome to the video. Sounds different. I'm somewhere else. Doesn't matter. Um, what I was doing? Oh yes, I literally just told me edit past me told editing me to tell you to play this game for yourself. It's really good and really silly. <laughs> and Correction: This game is free. I know I'm like three levels deep. But I'm gonna send you into the video real quick. Genuinely, just go, go get it, go play it first, and then watch me stumble through like an idiot. Or say, I don't care about spoilers and keep watching and know all the answers to the puzzles. Over to you, past me, who isn't in a motel screaming and without Wi Fi. <laughs> Okay, we'll call that editing. What the fuck? Okay. What's this way? This way is not where we're meant to go, so fuck it, let's go this way. As you saw, we draw lines. That is all I know about this game. What the fuck? What? So I just delete save file. Warning. This will erase all your progress. What? <laughs> I just thought, haha, I can go wrong way. And there's delete save file and... Alright. <laughs> I have even less idea on what this game is than I did before. So we go from here. Another face. Draw a sword. Okay. Doesn't count. Weird. Haha, <laughs> I don't have to obey the rules. Fuck your rules, I'm gonna jump outside the boundaries of reality. Damn, the moment it touches end, it goes to the next one. So yeah, as I said, the locker. I have no clue what anything is. I'm just going to explore. I cannot draw on the shield. Stop. Do not come in. Thank you for your understanding. I'm gonna figure out a way to get this door open. Do come in. 
If I cover up the dome, it should be coming. Right? How are you on playground if it do not climb? We'll come back to that one. What about big red button? You can do it. Huh? I believe in you. Oh, it says hint. <laughs> it's like, you can do it. I believe in you. <laughs> is that all it says? Is he not actually hint? Is it literally just like... This is all you. <laughs> yeah, keep trying. Yeah, there's a trick to it, but you've got it. I mean, I just keep yeah, on doing it. Uh, maybe, uh... Maybe keep... you can't do it. What? Maybe you're weak. Maybe you're stupid. You should be embarrassed, but you keep crawling back like a mewling calf at my chafing teat. Pathetic. You can do it. <laughs> I believe in you. <laughs> okay, so that was surprising. I also can't jump, which is my main method of breaking shit. Fuck your maze. Think outside the puzzle. Start a fire. Burn down society. I'm gonna just follow this code and see where it leads. Yeah. Well, it leads up here, which is something that's now powered, and is that the hint button? Did it make the hint button actually do something? Backpack? Was this a round of adventures? I can't draw on the bars. I think it did lead to the hint button. Does the hint button do something else now? This is all you. This is all you. Okay, I have no clue what it is trying to do. Okay, back to exploring. <laughs> there is fabric everywhere. Here's another one. That one was extremely easy. Damn. Kublai Khan received an ornate letter signed by Marco Polo. In Madrid, city of lost things, no item remains where it was set. If one drops his key in the dirt, he may never re-enter his home, and even if he manages to stoop and recover the key, he may rise to find a tulip garden where his house once stood. In complimentary fashion, things lost by others are forever turning up. A pocket watch on a coffee table. A fond memory in your recollection. I even know of a prince who turned up in a prison cell. When he appealed to the guards for his release, he failed to find the crown on his head. And when he was asked his name, he searched his thoughts, but could not find it. Damn. Indeed, the only hope now for the release of this prince of Spain is for you to send back 300 ducats for his release. Of course, he will reward you handsomely once he is out. Yours truly, Marco. Kublai Khan cocked an eyebrow and declared before his court, Hey everyone, looks like we're about to get ripped off by the guy who traded gold for paper. The court erupted in booming laughter. Italo Calvino, Invisible Cities 2, this time it's visible. <laughs> okay, that was just odd. If I cover the entire board and arrows, it will all line up, obviously. But 
Like, like I'm not lying. If I literally cover the entire board in red, it's got to line up somewhere. Now it's leading to the cube. Oh, I get it. I gotta get all three of these things to hit the cube. And then the cube's gonna open the wall. And then what's the wall gonna do? It's gonna give me money. Ah. Go on, get... Don't Go look on. at me. Hint button? Can you hear me? I'm nothing but a rusty chunk of steel. You don't want nothing to do with me. I do. What information all do you right, hold? Alright, alright. I'll tell you my story. It was June the 8th, 1947. Grey morning, what slightly foggy. What the fuck is this game? I had my own practice then, and I was living higher than a cosmonaut on a stepladder. My hints were subtle too, real subtle. Back then, they said, good old hint button. His hints could steal the tail off a weasel. What? <laughs> then they tossed me in the can. No what, no I know how. Those were the mean times. When all the common sense in the world won't make a nickel to buy you a black coffee. I used rope to tie my pants and pants to tie my shoes. I may do the way a man does. Until one day, after stealing the socks off a fireplace, I caught my own look in a puddle of bootleg rye and realized I had to do what I'd never done before. I gave myself a hint. What? So that's me. I was nothing but a downtown crumb who dreamed of being a whole sandwich. Now I'm just another sloppy Joe. Come back when you got something. Come back when you got a good one. Alright. I need to find... A good one, apparently. You guys know what that means? I don't. What happens if I talk to the hint button now? And by talking, you can do it? He's just like, you can do it! I haven't committed multiple war crimes. I can draw and stuff from a mile away. <laughs> That's funny. Um. I need to stop doing that, but also, why does my hand have clown fingers? I don't know why I'm calling crap. Whoa, this one's in colour. Yeah, I am not doing this. Now let's do it just for fun. This way, and down, and... I don't think this maze is actually possible. This one ain't possible too. Yeah, it just ain't possible. I need to stop doing that. What's in here? Something in there. Something gonna open that door. What if I just go... Worth a try. What about this? Nope. <laughs> Cannot just write start and end. Um, can't draw a bridge. 
Wow. Hmm. Oh, hey, another little speaker thing. What have you got information on? Through many births, I have wandered on and on, searching for, but never finding. Better deal than 0% APR on certified pre-owned vehicles. For trucks tougher than a drunk marine come to Mike's Pre-Owned, where we do the things that what? get things done. Huh? Mike's Pre-Owned? What does that even mean? Oh my god, wait. Oh, I think I need to use the, um, hint thing. Are we going to draw on the moon at some point? I feel like we're going to draw on the moon. Hey, old hint button, you guys for me? I'll tell you this. When life hauls off and hits me square in the speaker, I don't get mad and I don't give up. Over many nights of thinking hard and drinking hard, up till the morning lighting one cup of joe with a smoldering butt of the last slug of rum, this is what I learned. When you're up against the impossible, and there's no getting through it, you might just have to go around it. Get a look at the back of the box, if you get me. Read the nutrition facts, if and you follow. Hmm. Go around the back. Read the nutrition facts, if you follow. Hmm. Or maybe that was for the one that's like, the maze is literally impossible. It's gotta be somewhere where those lines get to. If I paint the entire canvas red, the thing will get through eventually. What? What the fuck? I was trying to end. What? What? I was trying to end it. Oh my god, it literally says start and end over here. Oh my god, I didn't see that. Oh, and now I've got natural maze. Come on. Have fun cheese me garbage. <laughs> I need to stop being terrible. <laughs> I'm doing that bit again. Why it bugged me? Let's go this way through the maze. And then we're stuck. Cause that's it in that 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 But this way to nothing. So this way This way leads to success If I can fucking draw a line without hitting a wall Hello? Can you hit a wall somewhere? Oh my god. Ah. There we go. Excuse me? If I squint hard enough to have an end do I want to look at the back of the box and read the contents? No. Hmm. 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 
up. Is there something above me? Nope. Um. Something in this bush. Beep. You're right there. I mean, beep. <laughs> okay, beep. okay. Oh, okay. Beep. This is the game we're playing. Beep! Come on, beep! 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 Oh, it's the other way. It's beep. 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 <laughs> oh, don't feel sad. Beep. Don't be sad. Beep. Yes, beep. Yeah, beep. Beep, beep, motherfuckers, study. Study. Be your line. Huh? What was... That was... That was the game saving. Stupid. Whoa, like... Hmm? Don't trust you. Okay. So now, as well as... Probably making me realize that thing there. It goes through here. And into the Elder Cube. Now, where does this one go? This one goes to the chessboard. You having fun? I'm having lots of fun. I'm gonna put a bit at the beginning that just says play this for yourself, it's free. But you got here, so you don't get that. Mostly because you already have got that. Oh yeah, baby! Uh oh I hate this Oh god! I suddenly hate this. I suddenly hate all of this. And we- Oh, where did I get a shotgun? Where the f*** did I get a shotgun? any of that? Pens? A door? Imagine gravity is fractal because light is just a wave and gravity is just a wave so imagine there's a big piece of glass that splits up gravity like a prism so that there's like blue gravity and yellow gravity and then somebody gets hit by the red gravity and it makes them super heavy so they have super strength but like they're also really slow and another Man. guy gets hit by microwave gravity. So he's trying to zap everybody. And just when he's about to zap the main guy, 
we see a lady come out, and she turns out to be Ultraviolet Girl, and she has super speed so she beats him. And it, like, also gave her giant cans. Thomas Pinchon, <laughs> Gravity's Rainbow. And it also gave her giant cans. <laughs> okay, I got it. This time, we're drawing the badassest of swords. Okay, it's a knife, but still. No, try putting some more loops on it. Loops. Loop de loop de loop de loop de loop. Now you have too many loops. Okay. That's very original. It was one loop. Now yeah, I was going for a smiley face. Hey, Mucky one, but there's nothing. Yes, I could go there, but what's this way? What the fuck is that? Oh, that's an old board. Damn, this is wizard stuff. The notion of two realities is uncomfortable, and in recent decades a genuine effort has been made to find the link between quantum and classical, so that we can have a single reality whose laws and rules are united at some deeper level. Oh God, this brings no. us back to prayers. Let's say that a prayer is a classical event, or feels like one. You, a unique individual, have a particular request, which you voice in words that no one else is speaking at that instant. What if this classical event gets processed at a non-local level? The notion isn't far-fetched, because it seems that the mind-body link does consist of fluctuations at the quantum level. If this is so, then any thought, not just a prayer, has quantum implications. Deepak Chopra, A Spiritual Mystery, Does God Listen to Prayers, Part 2. Damn, that was interesting. Ah! Ah! ah why? Oh, oh God! God why? Ah! Why, the fuck why did I do fun? that? <laughs> oh! I looked into it because what if there was a thing on the sun? But I had the exact same reaction. Like I was expecting for there to be a thing on the sun. <laughs> I don't know why that's really funny to me. It shouldn't be. That was really unpleasant. That unpleasant I reacted the exact same way as he did. Bin overflow. Okay, let's see what's on the other side of this door. Probably more horror and questions like where did I get the shotgun? Who moved the statue? Was I actually slitting people's throats without knowing? Why is this game so pretty? Damn. And now here's another one. Start to finish. Start to finish. Oh wait, I think I got it. I don't know why I decided to do that to clear the board. Never eat sour watermelon. They either need to be separate or I need to do them in order of like knots and crosses. Oh, here's the answer. Two JB with. Not only is the novice unable to perceive the board as the master does, but the master cannot perceive the board as the novice does. A master cannot see the bishop on E3 as a chunk of dead wood any more than you can look at your best friend's face and see a meaningless matrix of colors and shapes. The master once saw the board like this, but now there is no going back. 
International Master Stuart Rachel's The Reviled Art. You can only get good at chess if you love the game. Grandmaster Bobby Fisher. What the fuck is any of this? <laughs> oh, it just taught me that they have to be on that separate ones have to be a separate, so one that one and that one. I hate chess. I hate chess. I hate chess. World champion, Bobby Fischer. <laughs> I kind of love that. The world champion of chess was just like, Ah oh yes, I love chess, I love chess, I love chess. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. <laughs> You just jump down, maybe. Oh, you know what it's probably gonna be? It's probably gonna be something like, um... Oh, damn, I can go down here? It's probably gonna be something like those in it. <gasps> Pirate ships! A ship owner was about to send to sea a venerable old ship. He knew that her barnacled hull, however, had often needed repairs, and doubts were suggested to him that possibly she was not seaworthy. The conscientious old captain thought at once to have her thoroughly refitted, even though it should put him at great expense. Before the ship sailed, however, he managed to stifle these bothersome misgivings, and said to himself that she had gone safely through so many voyages that it was idle to suppose that this trip should be any different. He put his trust in Providence, and banished from his mind all ungenerous suspicions about the honesty of the ship's builders, and in such ways he acquired a sincere and comfortable conviction that his vessel was altogether safe and seaworthy. He watched her departure with a light heart, encouraging the crew to dream of the profits that this voyage would return. And he got his insurance money, when she went down in mid-ocean and told no tales that his belief in the safety of his ship was justified because it was grounded in repeated practical experimentation rather than the hubris of rationalistic a priori belief. It is admitted that he put his confidence in the builders of this vessel, but even this confidence was misplaced, for these were the selfsame charlatans who sought to sell him gratuitous repairs later on, and Big Ship is always trying to get one over on the little guy. Further, we may see that the ship is religion, and the shipwright is Richard Dawkins. The crewmates are empiricism, and the barnacles are neoplatonism, and the captain of that ship was Albert Einstein. What the hell was I talking about? No one fucking knows. I gotta go for a moment. I will be right back. Fuckers, I am back. Okay. So, last thing it said was something, something, dude didn't want to clean off the barnacles from his boat. And something, something, Christianity? After the boat sank. Oh, hey! They gave me the controls. They probably did that at the beginning, but I looked away. <laughs> okay, so what's over here then? Oh! Leak down there. Cannons, yes, please. And notes. I don't even have letters. But there is a knife. I 
think, you know, could be useful. Shit. Damn, they be pirate vessels. Could I just... No, I cannot walk off a cliff. So what if I stand like... What if I stand like this? Fire! Haha, <laughs> that is so cool! The fact that you can do it from anywhere, so... Fire! <laughs> what if we move in the last second? Nope. And if I line up just right... Fire! There we go. Some some part of that was an arrow. Teach girl it seems to touch higher. And then Damn, as it gets further away, this is harder. There we go. Fire! Something open because of that. There's something else I meant to shoot at. There one way back there. Can't aim that high. So I don't think so. Maybe it opened this. Yeah. Please don't be more creepy shit. Oh my god, an arcade room? Yes, please. Oh, and this is the area that this was. I saw that file from up there. I'm almost specifically making this part of myself.
trace over this line. I'm trying to take up as little space as I can. What else is it? Oh god, but that's gonna be the end because of that. Victory. Yeah, genuinely I couldn't- Oh hey, that did something! I wasn't expecting that to do something. It opened the door. I- I did not expect that to do something. I thought that was just fun, endless mode. Wait a second, this is a door. It is literally this door. Okay, so what's up then? Because over here opened. Start to end. There's a controller. This is. Oh!
Vem cá. So now we get to the cube. We couldn't solve it before because we couldn't see it. What is it? It's a camera? A light. A laser cannon? Detector? It's got a little one on top of it. Is that just gonna stop doing the same thing? It's a heavy, it's an overdone laser pointer. Open, open the castle gates. It is literally a laser pointer. A very loud laser pointer. Oh, what the fuck are you pointing up for? What, 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 what's happening? Power to the solar to the. It's giving power to the solar panel. <laughs> Open, and we're back in here with the solar panel now working. That's how it works. Okay, this looks like some magic shit. I don't think we need to care about the symbols because I'm gonna just... Where in the world is this thing not connected? Yeah. Oh, come on! Ball monkey! I demand a recount! I have no clue, I'm going to the hint boxes. Give me my out for any more. Also, if I remember correctly, something went in here, I think. No? Was it the other one? I think it was the other one. We can't even get into the other one? We can get in here. And this one led up. Okay, yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot about this one. What did that do? Did that send this one to here? <gasps> oh my god, the key! Can you get close to it? God damn, this thing's so small. Oh my god, it's opening! It is opening! No, no, no. Oh my god, it is opening! Oh my god, it's another puzzle! What is the puzzle? Is it gonna teach me the wizard shit? You're kidding me! It's one of those silly kids menu things! Kids menu! Shit. 
I failed at the child's maze. I can't believe it. All these other ones, and I failed to the children's one. <gasps> the force field is gone. New area with buckets of go. And more ominous humming. What is over here? Is this an actual maze? It is an actual maze. I think I'm meant to get to the center of it. I cannot walk into the sea. Oh, I'm hearing from the thing. Time for actual maze. Okay. Stick right. I'm just sticking right. I will find my way through eventually. Unless this is somehow a completely separate part of the maze. I'm just gonna stick right. Right has never failed me. I will correct that. Right has failed me twice now. But I'm sticking with it. It'll be right eventually. Although technically this might be left, but also... Yeah, I am making left turns, but still. Still sticking right. That's what I'm looking for in its own, like... Completely floating section of walls that I will never get to by sticking on the right. But if that's the case, well. shit. Okay, I'm glad I did that. So, there's a church in the middle of the maze. With a knight. And an angel. Let me guess, there's a puzzle on the pedestal? Yeah. Okay, so this is going to tell me the order. Brown. Oh damn, it's like... Yeah, so it's crown... Two things. Moon... Timer? Okay, what about... I don't think I'm understanding the puzzle. Is it based on complexity? Is it like... Bam, bam, bam or something? I think it is based on complexity. It's like least complex this 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 Okay wait no 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 If it's 
based on complexity, this, 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 and then this? Right. This, 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 this. You're the least complex, and then you... Fuck. This one. This one. This one. This one. This one, this one, this one, this one? Is it up, 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 up? Is that the solution? No. <laughs> if that's not the solution, okay. Okay, the last one, it doesn't matter if the last one recorded or not. Doesn't matter if the last one recorded or not. Because, I put the, um, I didn't make much progress anyway. I'm still right here, trying to figure this out. And I think it is complexity. If it's here, I have to use it. These are all crosses. I've only just realised these are all crosses. See? Two sides. More than two sides. This one. This one has... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine points. One, four, hourglass. See, I'm thinking we ain't the hang of it. So three, more than three, hourglass. Triangle. This one. <sighs> yeah, see? I think I accidentally did something. Okay, um. Triangle. Two, like three ish. Four, five, six, seven. Eight. Nine. See? This literally unlocks nothing. It is a tutorial. Literally nothing was unlocked by this. Except for enlightenment. Is there a way this way? What's this way? Nothing. Okay, so, that was all just so I get the logic behind it, it's based on what's more complicated. Now, if I keep on going on the left, I will figure out how to get out. See, look at what I told you. 
I wouldn't have followed if I didn't divert. I would have actually just been stuck there forever. <laughs> it's going in circles. All right, we have gotten past the wall, past all of this, past the flipping kids menu. What does it even say on it? I don't want to get back to this. That was a insane lag spike. How do I get up here? It's this way. It is this way. I don't like the ominous hum of that thing. It's very loud. More. Okay, and now complexity. What is the least complex thing here? This one. With two sides. Then... Five. Two. Four. Five. Six. Seven, two, four, five, six, seven, then eight. Okay, so that's one, two, three, four, no wait, back the other way. Back this way, into here. This one, this one, and then done. Yes! Oh my god! That took so bloody much. No. You're not serious. Oh my god, and that's why the carpets are there. Can you draw onto that tree? Yes. Can draw on the light, the literal light. Can I uh, get over there by this? But I need to find a way to connect up. Hmm. If I draw on the carpet, I can do the grass. Never mind, I've got it. And then we use the light. No. Okay, wait, go. Can you move this sack of junk? To draw onto this wall, which then we can draw this wall all the way over to the E. Is 
that work? Is that enough red lines? Did everything connect? Yes! It has all been amazing this whole time! The obelisk of knowledge. The obelisk of knowledge. That was the obelisk of knowledge backwards, I can just tell. What is the obelisk of knowledge? Oh my god! Stones of reflection. Stones of reflection. No. Not the. Oh wait, it's a giant cat. Some kind of whiz with a computers. Wait, 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 wait. Good stack of pennies. I would never hurt you. The the plate. Let's see. Easy one. Nerd shit. Now that's a book. Puzzle book for you. <laughs> ah, one more puzzle before retirement. No. Damn, I bang my hair. What happened? Um. Oh my god, it's starting to happen. I'm starting to see those patterns just in the stuff I have up in my room. It didn't draw. Okay. I also had a look at the achievements. I want to get the last achievement. Welcome to the end of the video. I will tell you, I have gotten all the achievements. And I should hit save on this. Now I have. <laughs> Game was a lot of fun. I hope you played it for yourself. You better have. I specifically told future past me to do it.
And now with this many layers deep into the thing. Screw you, I want to. I hope you enjoyed the video. It was fun. You better have played the game. It took me far too long to make this. And I was on holiday. It is almost 3 in the morning. I was on holiday, so that's why this video was late. But in the future, I'm still going to aim for videos every Friday. And maybe a couple lower effort me talking about shit videos. Other times. I don't know what to say. Subscribe if you feel like it. Like if you want to. If you want to. Alright, bugger off. Just play more content that you gotta watch today. Play more things you gotta procrastinate on. It's already been two minutes. Just move along. M move along. M move along. Go to the S. There we go. Video can end.